Okay, I just want to start this video off by saying I am a very big fan of coupons, do not get me wrong. During the times that I was extremely broke and had no cash, especially during college, the only way that I would be able to eat a lot of fast food whenever I wanted was through coupons, so there's a very special place in my heart for them. But like all good things, coupons expire. They're not going to last forever, and while I work at the subway, there's been a lot of times where somebody will come in with an expired coupon, and well, this would lead to some controversy. First, I think about 85% of you guys aren't subscribed so if you're not subscribed please subscribe and turn on bell notifications but during my early years in college i i worked at the subway almost every single day and so when somebody would come in with a coupon you know i was always in favor of it i was i was the kid that used coupons so if you're gonna use a coupon with me let's do it now me personally whenever i've tried to use an expired coupon and i'm not gonna lie there's been a couple times where i've wanted to use an expired coupon almost every actually not even almost i've never gotten away with using an expired coupon i've tried it at my wendy's i tried it at my mcdonald's when they used to send coupons but never once did somebody say oh it's okay this is expired i'm gonna give it to you anyway nope unfortunately that's just not how the world works but meanwhile at my subway well there were a couple times where somebody would walk in and the coupon either expired the day before or like even sometimes a couple days before and well i would let them go i mean i'm obviously my boss isn't gonna be happy to hear this aka my mom i'm sorry mom but i would just let them go because i figured you know they're gonna remember this kind act hopefully and who knows maybe it makes them a customer for a much longer time but well when you're abusing Using kindness and you're trying to get get away with like a lot longer than one day expiration or even two day expiration that's when we get into some problems not gonna lie so one of the most prime examples of this happening to me was that a lady came in with like an entire coupon book like it was like one of those full pages of coupons and she was all by herself and she wanted to use five coupons simultaneously and I you know I I'm a couponer myself don't get me wrong but to use five coupons like she literally wanted me to give her like 10 sandwiches for the price of four which is like I, come on now like i i don't think that we could do that and well that wasn't even the craziest part literally this entire page of coupons was all expired and when i pointed that out to her she kind of lost her mind she was not happy with me and she said this is ridiculous i'm just gonna take these to another subway because you guys clearly don't respect my service and we're not talking like one or two days expired these have literally been expired for like almost a month and i i just told her i was like listen i'm gonna cut you some slack here i'm gonna let you use one of these coupons you're not gonna use five of them but you could use one of these coupons and we'll get you taken care of today but this is just me I, I don't think anybody else is gonna do this for you and if they do i don't know i don't know what to tell you but she reluctantly agreed which is crazy like i accepted a coupon that was a month old and she was still upset about it somehow but i made her the sandwich basically it was a buy one get one free of course she got the two most loaded sandwiches on earth but i i literally did not feel like arguing with this woman at three o'clock in the afternoon during my shift i just wanted to go home so i ring it up she complains about the price a little bit it, that's that and she walks out and i think okay this is over well nope it was far from over literally the next day the same woman comes into the subway while i'm working and she's trying to use her coupons with my coworker. And my coworker was just kind of like uh malad can you come over here and help me out with this and i'm like oh god i i recognize this woman and you know i had to kindly tell her again listen i can't accept these coupons like i'm sure in like one or two weeks you're just gonna get brand new ones in the mail from subway but like we can't do this today i'm sorry i know I accepted them yesterday and well she took the opportunity to remind me about how I literally let her use a coupon yesterday and well I, I told her I was like listen yesterday I literally told you that we can't do this and uh, it, it was like all the way back to square one she starts saying to me this is ridiculous I'm never coming back to the subway again yada 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 and at this point I'm just kind of like you know what all right I got a line literally like out the door I gotta help customers it's like kind of a lunch rush right now if you don't want to if, if you don't want to have a sandwich here and you don't want to like give us your business that's okay you're entitled to that it's it's a free country we live in america for god's sake and i think this kind of threw her out she gave me like a pretty big you know like uh i don't want to say the curse words but like she was not happy with me at all and she walked right out and the guy behind her was like huh that, that was that was kind of crazy and i was like yep that's just another day of a subway worker if you enjoyed this video please feel free to like and subscribe and well i hope that lady out there is somewhere doing well i don't know i love you guys peace